Kathy Chenna here with Catching Up with Kathy on Tri-City TV. And I'm here at a local restaurant in the heart of Port Moody, Spacanapoli. I feel like I'm in Little Italy and back in my own hometown of Calabria. But Calabria is a bad word according to the people from Napoli itself, which is also known as Naples. We're going to be talking to the owners here today, find out what their specialty is and what gets ordered the most and why the crowd has been coming here in droves, waiting 30 minutes or more just to get into this lovely restaurant. Well, Naomi, what an amazing establishment that you've brought here to Port Moody, Moody Center, right in the heart of Port Moody. I feel like I'm in Little Italy. Tell us what your inspiration was behind putting together Spacca Napoli. Well, we are an Italian family, and uh, I moved here uh, with my family nine years ago. Then I, I met my husband, uh, Giovanni, uh, that he moved here three years ago, and his brother is a pizzaiolo. Um, him always worked in the industry of the hospitality and we as a family always had a passion of pizza together with my brother-in-law um, so we just you know uh, had this dream always of having a, this Italian uh, pizzeria and bringing uh, our uh, uh, authenticity and our uh, culture and our food to the community so the, the heart of this place it's our pizzeria so our wood oven that came from Naples and uh, it's an authentic uh, wood oven to bake you know pizza napoletana to cook and uh, if it wasn't for our pizzaiolo Marco who learned to make his dough in Naples and he learned all the tricks uh, over many years in Naples of experience uh, the, the, all this could not happen because being a pizzaiolo, it's a big sacrifice. You have you work long hours. He comes here early morning. He makes the dough. He let it rise for 24 hours, and he uses the day after. So it's a 24 hours rise. And at the same time, he stretch the dough, and he also, even if he can, he tries uh, cooking in the oven himself. But sometimes, with this busy, he doesn't need help. So, in your opinion, what has been the favorite pizza that's been ordered? Oh yeah, I have that 100%. I have, uh, well, the margherita, who's the queen of all pizza, the, here it is. Our tomato sauce, mozzarella, fior di latte, and fresh basil, that's the number one. But also we have a couple one, which is boscaiola, with the smoked cheese, uh, sausage, mushroom, and tomato sauce, and also the uh, prosciutto e funghi, which is uh, margherita with some prosciutto, uh, cotto, and fu and mushroom. Marco, what, why are you making pizza for a living? What's the passion behind making this pizza? I born with pizza in my blood, you know. All my family will become a pizza maker. My mom, she teach me how to make dough. My grandma, she teach me dough. So all my family, we are pizza makers. So. And is there something special about the dough that you're making that makes this pizza so different from others? Oh, yes. This recipe is from my nonna, my grandma. You know, it become family by, by my family. You know? So uh, I can't know the secret, right? No, you cannot. <laughs> Can you make me a Nutella pizza? Well, sure, I know. Can okay. you give me one kiss? Uh, where? Here. Thank you. Two ways. Thank you. See you. Ciao. Ciao. It's Kathy Chenna here with Tri-City Community TV. I'm in the heart of Port Moody at Spacca Napoli. I've been here three times. It's fantastic. The food is not a disappointment at all. And I love it. It brings me back to my heritage. So if you want a little bit of Italian in your life, come on down to Spacca Napoli. If you have a restaurant or a hot spot that you want me to check out, check me out at kathychenna.com and let's catch up soon. Mm -hmm.